Hey Internet, my name is Aqua and you're watching Aqua Vlog. Hello Internet, my name is Aqua and you're watching the Aqua Vlog. Look at these lights! I guess you can't really look at them because I'm not showing them to you right now. Maybe I'll take a picture of them or something. But they're cool. So this last week hasn't been too awful exciting. I've pretty much just been sitting here doing stuff because, uh... My job laid me off for some reason, without telling me, giving me any notice or anything, they just kind of stopped giving me hours and, uh, disabled my account thing that's, I have this, like, little phone app thing that was for scheduling, and my account just got disabled one day, I'm like, huh, that's weird. So I tried to go in and, like, talk to the dudes and be like, hey, is this a thing? And I also emailed the support of the hot schedules thing, which is what the app is called, and they are like, yeah, your account just doesn't exist anymore. I'm like... Cool. So I tried to go in my work and talk to the dude. He wasn't there, but I wasn't on the schedule at all. So I was like, well, guess I got to find another new job. So that's what I've been doing a lot of this week is just trying to find jobs, applying to places and stuff like that, which isn't fun at all. It's really boring and dumb and stupid, but kind of have to do that in order to, you know, pay rent and stuff. So there's that. I did have an opportunity to go work at one of the venues that I work at. But it wasn't for a show or anything, it was just replacing a console, and I'm going to be doing something next week as well for uh, just, like, cleaning out some stuff, because there's a bunch of, like, things stacked on top of each other that do different things, like, I'm trying to remember, I think they're all EQs, equalizers, and just got to open them up, dust them out and stuff so they don't overheat and catch on fire or something, because that's bad. Yeah. Yeah, mostly just been uh, looking for work and applying at places and making videos, which is what I prefer to do, really. But unfortunately, that's not all I can do in my life or at this point in time. Maybe in the future, I can just sustain myself off of making videos, and that would be free and awesome. But for now, I have to do other things that suck. Also, usually I've been having my hair up like in a ponytail, but I wanted to keep it like this so I could show how long it's getting. I really need to get a haircut. It's like, I'm, it's to the point right now where it's like, this is probably the longest that I want it. This is actually longer than I want it, really. But having up in a ponytail or a bun is all right, which is what I normally do. My glasses keep slipping on my face too. But uh, it's getting pretty. It's getting pretty long. Yeah, I guess the other thing I mentioned, but I should talk about a little bit more, is the lighting change here. I actually I got some money for Christmas and I got some like gift card stuff for Christmas, so I used that to improve, you know, video stuff. So. I bought some ni nice lights, some nice lightings, there's two softbox, like I said, maybe I'll take a picture of them or something. I don't know, Aqua, if you took a picture of it, put it up now. That means I have to take a picture of it later. Why do I keep making my work for myself? But I was able to get them for really cheap, and I figured I'm not going to be able to get that kind of deal again, so I just kind of went ahead and did it. And it pretty much didn't cost me anything, so it was all just with gift card stuff, so... Eh! So all my recording and stuff just stopped. Uh, I accidentally hit the microphone, and I hit the USB cable in my microphone, because I don't have a nice XLR microphone yet. And apparently that just kind of stopped all the recording. I think it's all fine, though, so I'll have that first part. But anyway, the only other really major thing that I can think of that happened this week is that I kind of biffed it on some ice yesterday. I was going to a restaurant with my cousin, and he decided to take an alleyway that was covered in ice, because it's faster, and it totally was. But, uh... And I've never slept on ice before, so I was like, oh, this will be fine, whatever. And, uh, I don't have shoes that are good for grip on anything except, like, I don't know, anything except ice, really? Like, asphalt, tennis courts, anything with, like, a little bit of, like, grippy surface, because they're, they're, like, the bottoms are, like, totally flat. So if there's a little bit of, like, texture on the surface, then it's, like, perfect. But for something like ice, there's nothing. It's, like, a flat surface on a slippery surface. And that just does that, so that's what happened. I kind of got a little, I got a little cut on my hand, for a little focus, yeah, there you go. I got a little cut on my hand, but I like landed directly on my shin, and that kind of took off a little bit of skin, like a kind of decent amount of skin, actually. I didn't bleed on anything, really, thankfully. It was actually not very deep at all, which is good, but boy, did that hurt like hell. And it still does if it gets touched at all, so I've been trying to like keep it wrapped up with some gauze and stuff like that. But, uh, I'll be fine, it just sucked, and it might suck for a little bit. I, I, when I took a shower yesterday, and the water, like, running down my leg, just that was like, Oh, God, why? But it should be fine now. 
As far as stuff on the channel goes, I've been really, really impressed and uh, happy with the performance of everything. Um, I'm really happy that people seem to be like coming in and enjoying stuff because uh, I've gotten a subscriber almost every day for the last few days and I've been getting a lot of views coming in and watch time and everything like that, so that's really cool. I guess people are liking my videos that are watching them, so yay! Hopefully I can keep making videos that people like. That's kind of the whole goal here. I also started live streaming Half-Life 1, which is something I didn't really think of doing, but uh, during the winter sale it was available for like two bucks. And I really, really like the Half-Life series. Well, I like Half-Life 2 and all of the like Half-Life 2 Episode 1 and Episode 2. And I've played all those already, but I've never played the original. And I didn't really know what to expect from it. Like, I've seen some gameplay of it. I also watched uh, Freeman's Mind, which is a parody kind of thing of a dude playing through Half-Life. And I think it's scripted. It's it's definitely scripted. Um, at least the speech part. I don't know how the whole game... I don't know how it was produced, really. If it was, like, the script was, like, made and you're just going through. Or if it was, like, you do the gameplay thing and then the script was made afterward. But it was really good. And you should go watch it. It's just like a 50 episode series. It's kind of like a, it's basically like what a scripted let's play would be. And it's, it's not even that really. It's as if the person playing was Gordon Freeman. And it's like what's going through his mind as going through everything. And there's a lot of really funny stuff in it. Like there's a lot of like running jokes and there's a lot of really funny stuff in it. So you should definitely go check it out. But uh, he does show like the entirety of the game pretty much. And so I've seen it through that. Uh, there are some sections that he, like, skips over some things, I think. I'm pretty sure. I haven't played the game, so I don't know. Uh, but I haven't played it myself. And I was really interested to it. And it's been a year since I've seen that series anyway, so I don't know, like, hardly anything that's going on besides... I know what the final boss is, and my friend told me it years ago, so it wasn't really a spoiler kind of thing. But I'm really excited to play through it, and I played two hours of it last night, and... It's really awesome, actually. I was surprised, like, how fast-paced it was and everything like that. Not just because you freaking go sprinting, running crazy fast everywhere for some reason, but it's just, like, everything is, like, there's something always happening. And I haven't played Half-Life 2 in so long that I kind of forgot how that series worked exactly. And it's just, it's very well designed, just in a lot of ways. I could go on about it for, like, an hour, so I'm not going to. But, uh, basically, you should either go watch my playthrough... Which is, I'm I'm going pretty fast through it. I will say, I am not really, like, taking time to, like, explore places like I probably should be. But I haven't really seen many places to explore, necessarily. There are a couple places that I was like, oh, I'll just go this way and come back and, like, look at this stuff. But it turns out the way I went was progression. And I got, like, locked out of it sometimes. So that was kind of unfortunate. But, uh... Yeah, it's freaking awesome. And speaking of scripted videos, I actually have a video that I'm working on that I actually need to start writing the script for. But it's a... Uh, I, I guess I can say it's a video of all of the Undertale secrets of the fun value, which is, if you don't know what that is, it's uh, something in the files of Undertale where uh, there's like a, just a bunch of variables listed and one of them is called fun. And if you capitalize that, and change the number of it and go to certain places, then certain things can happen that won't happen in the main game, or at least there's like a very, very crazy small chance of them happening. I have seen people posting about, it's like, hey, I found this thing, what is this? This is just out of nowhere. And people are like, oh yeah, that's that thing. Uh, we didn't know that was actually possible to get in the main game, so hey, that's cool. It's really freaky stuff, honestly. I'll, uh, I won't spoil anything about it, because you, I want you to watch the video. <laughs> But I'm hoping it's going to be a really cool thing. It's going to be my first attempt at trying to script something and uh, putting all this stuff together. I got a lot of the filming done for it already, and it's pretty much just going to be putting it together a certain way, editing it, and uh, getting the script written, and doing the voiceover for it. So it might be a little while. I'm hoping to get it out later this week, but I honestly don't know if that's going to be a thing <laughs> that I'll be able to do. It's probably going to take a bit longer, but uh, I'm hoping to uh, work on it a pretty good amount. In the meantime, so I guess look forward to that. I think that's going to be pretty much it for this week. Uh, not a whole lot has happened, so I talked about pretty much everything that's happened. Like I do every week. I try to make these videos every week, and things don't always happen, so I just kind of have to babble on for a little while. But hopefully you enjoyed it, I guess.
I don't know. But anyway, yeah, that's it for this week. There you go. I did the vlog. Also, backdrop thing, I think I talked about this last week as well. So, whatever. It's fine. As always, thank you to everyone who's been supporting the channel. I very, very much appreciate it, and I'm very glad to see some, uh, at least based on, you know, just analytics and stuff like that, like seeing the views and watch time and all that stuff going up, that people are enjoying my content more. And I'm hoping to be able to continue to make better things, and I'm going to try my hardest to... A, get a video out every day, which I have done so far, and I count the live stream VOD as a video, so don't say I didn't do a video today because I did a live stream and I put the VOD up. That's what counts for that. But I just want to be able to put more time toward it, so I'm going to try to get just ahead in videos. Like, I'm going to try to get a lot of stuff recorded today so I can, like, get a lot of things edited so I could be, like, two or three days ahead instead of just being like, oh, God, video's due today. I don't have anything edited yet. Uh. I've always had stuff recorded, thankfully, but I haven't had to, like, record, edit, and upload all in one day. But I have had to edit and upload in one day, which isn't great. It's not a good, it's not what I want at all. So I'm going to try to fix that, basically. There you go. So that'll be it for this week, and I'll see you next week. Bye!